guys welcome back to my channel how are you doing i hope you guys are doing amazing sending positive vibes to everyone that is watching this video so today i have a couple of new products and i know you guys like these kind of videos so i want to show you what i got if you're not subscribed don't forget to do so and turn on your little bell so you can get notified every single time i post a new video so without further ado guys let's jump right in so I do want to start off with my new scents that I got from Dossier. You guys know that I'm obsessed with Dossier. Dossier is honestly an amazing company. They make inspired fragrances from other fragrances. For example, YSL, Chanel, Tom Ford, Joe Malone. And you guys know that I love fragrances and I wouldn't be talking about a brand that I did not love. Like, Dossier has a really special place in my heart, and every single time I get new fragrances, I get so excited. One, because they smell so delicious. Every single one that I have smells really, really good, and two, they're just so beautiful. I love how simple they are, and I'm gonna stop blabbing, I'm gonna show you the new two scents that I got. So every single time that you order one, this is what it comes like. It does have a little card with the information on the fragrance that you chose. They do have men and women and unisex, which is pretty cool. So the one that I have here is inspired by Tom Ford Lost Cherry Eau de Perfume. It is 80% concentration, which is really good. And guys, when I tell you that this is spot on, like, I don't know how they do it. I always say they do some kind of witchcraft or I don't know how the heck they do it. They have really good people working there and it smells so good. I love that it has the top, middle, and base notes on the bottle. It's super simple. I love it. It smells delicious. I actually have this one on and oh my god. The lasting power on this is really good. I cannot complain. It's really, really nice. So if you're into like cherry scents... It smells divine, guys. It smells really good. The top notes are cherry, almond, and cinnamon. The middle notes are clove, rose, jasmine, and plum. And the base notes are peru, balsam, tonic, bean, and vanilla. I love vanilla scents. So the fact that I can smell like vanilla all day with that little hint of like fruit, obsessed. So the second one that I got is this one right here. I got the one that is inspired by Chanel Coco Mademoiselle uh, de Perfume. This is 50% concentration and this one does come with a little sample. So a lot of the fragrances have them, a lot don't. It just depends on what you actually receive in the mail. So this one does come with a little sample and of course if you don't like it, you're able to send it back which I think is really, really nice of them. And again, this is the bottle. We have the top, middle, and base notes. The top is magnetic, so you cannot lose this. This smells divine, guys. This is for, like, a grown woman. Really, really nice, like, elegant. I don't know. I imagine, like, a woman in a suit, you know, a boss. This smells really, really good. If you are interested in purchasing any of the fragrances that I just showed you or any other ones, because honestly, they have so many to choose from, in the description box below is a link for your convenience. Also, you're able to save some money off, so I think that is really cool. So now, guys, let's get on to the haul. I honestly don't even know what to start with because I have a little bit of everything. So I guess I'm just going to start with the lashes that I found. You guys know that I love Ayani lashes. They are super cheap. These lashes, you can find them at Dollar Tree, but I'm going to say that they are hard to find because I've been looking for a dramatic lash like the one I'm going to show you for months, okay? And this specific lash came out months ago. So whenever you see these, I honestly highly recommend them, especially if you're barely getting into makeup. You guys know that sometimes it's hard to find or to buy things when you're barely starting out, but these are a dollar, guys. These are the Ioni 3D Foam Mink Lash in Wispy Dramatic. Get into this lash. Tell me that this lash is not beautiful, guys. If you guys like a dramatic lash or if you want to build up your kit, you're barely starting out, I honestly think this lash is really pretty. I do have another pair which are more of a natural pair and I like the fact that I have two different pairs just in case if my client wants something super simple or they want something dramatic, I got it too. So I got eight pairs because like I said, I can't find these everywhere I go. So I got these, I stocked up. Every single time I see them or any kind of pair, I do stock up because like I said, these aren't easy to find. 
but yeah these are stunning and a little tip that i can give you guys if you want to do them more fluffy or if you want to see them a little bit more fluffy you could go over them with a spoolie and it makes them really nice but i like when they're like together like this it makes my eyes look really good and honestly i'm keeping two of these and the rest are going to my kids because i i really like these so moving on i did go to sephora i don't know like about two weeks ago with my sister and we found these from the Sephora brand. They are the Glow Peel Pads Glycolic Acid, uh, Radiance, and Smooth. So I have tried these. I actually tried them the day that I got them. And this is what they look like. I'll take one now so you can see how thin they are because they're really thin. I really like these guys. These were buy two and get 15% off. And these feel really good on the skin. I like to use it in the nighttime before I go to bed it left my skin so smooth it's kind of crazy and they were super cheap so if you're looking for like a glow peel um, pad those are really really good moving on I I'm pretty sure if you have TikTok, you saw this it went viral this is the melee rosemary mint scalp and hair strengthening oil this everybody raves about it I don't know if it works but I'm not afraid to try it. I'm going to try it and see how it goes. I'm actually going to start using it tonight. So we shall see if it actually works. It smells really good. Like it smells like minty, which I really like. And I feel like it's going to feel really good on my scalp. So I love products like these. I also got the hair mask, which is in my shower. I cannot wait to use it. Um, I did want the shampoo and the conditioner, but I couldn't find them. So I might get them from Amazon because they're a little hard to find since they went viral. The next product I got is this Desi Mist. It's the Do Me Over Prep Set and Refresh Face Mist. Again, I saw this and to me, Desi is so beautiful and her products are so cool. I do want to get the Claro Que Si Vitamin C Serum. But I'm like, you know what? Let me try this first. And guys, I tried this. I couldn't help myself. This feels so good on my skin. Like I have it on today. And you can see how glowing my skin looks. It feels so good. This is what she looks like. I'm going to put some on so you can see how it just comes out. And it keeps going and going and going. Like It could keep going if I actually wanted to. But I just don't want to waste the product, you know? I like this so much that I'm actually going to buy one for my kit. It doesn't have a scent, which I like because a lot of people don't like scents. And I really enjoy it. It's really, really nice. I am wondering if I could take everything off and like fill it in with anything that I want after I'm done. So I'm going to do that. And if I can, I'm going to keep the bottle because sometimes I like to make my own face mists. And if I could do that with that spray, it's going to be bomb.com. So moving on, I did get the Be Perfect Cosmetics Shape Shifter palette from Zachary and Cole's World. They are so good at makeup and I saw this and I'm like, yes, I need it. I need it. So this is what it looks like. I love that it's magnetic. Like this is so cool. I haven't seen anything like this. I don't know about you guys. I love Be Perfect products. I actually got the Antidote antidote um palette and the liquid shadows so i'm going to be doing a review on it really really soon and of course looks for you guys so this is the first part let me show you the inside we do have a big mirror and these are the colors super super pretty i actually have um sun bum which is this one right here on and i love how my skin looks I'm obsessed with this like this is something that I had to use I literally used it today and it has been sitting here for about like a week and a half and then this is Zachary's part can we talk about these colors I love I came to the conclusion that I love orange tones on my cheeks like I, I just found that out after 30 million years the shade that I have on today is this one and you can see it's really dark in the pan but if you really use it lightly it looks really good on the skin like I like how this looks and then I also have this one in my inner corners and my skin looks really good I really like these they all did themselves when it comes to these both palettes and I love how they are magnetic they look so cool so yeah if you're looking for a palette bronzing and blush highly highly obsessed with that one I'm probably gonna say that a lot that I'm obsessed with this and I'm obsessed with that because I really am I can't help myself 
So this next product is a palette. This palette, I have been seeing it for a long time. And I just didn't want to buy it. I don't know why. But deep down inside, I'm like, you know what? This would be a really good addition to my collection because I love to collect eyeshadow palettes. I got the P. Louise um, palette. This might still be on their website. I got it for a cheaper price because I know that they're going to discontinue this specific palette and i think three more the other ones are colorful but this to me is like a bridal palette something softer like for a soft glam and can you see how huge this is this is the most coolest palette i think i have like this is so beautiful when i show you guys the colors if you haven't seen this oh my god you're gonna go crazy we have a mirror and it does come with a protector and look at these colors oh my god these are stunning. They are so beautiful. We have a little bit of everything in here. And I honestly cannot wait to use this. I did dip into some of the colors just to swatch them. And these are beautiful. Like, I cannot complain about this palette. This palette is beautiful. And I'm so excited that I got it. I'm even debating about buying another one if they're still available. Because that's how much I like that palette. And I'm just crazy like that. I like to buy palettes that I know that are worth it. So, moving along, I bought more products from Brazil. I know this lady, she sells products. And honestly, I'm obsessed with Brazil, Colombia, and all those places. Products, I think that they're way better from the ones that we have in the U.S. I don't know about you guys. But I did get some products from Ana Paula Marcal or Masal Makeup. I love her brand. I've noticed that her brand is really, really good. And her prices are so cheap. Like, they're crazy cheap. So, I got four high cover concealer camouflage concealers. <laughs> and these shades that I got, well, I'll open them for you guys so you can see them from the inside. It's huge. And these were under $10, I believe. When they came out, when she got them, these were under $10. And honestly, there's so much product in here. This is AP05. So this is what it looks like inside. This did come from Puerto Rico and then from Brazil to Puerto Rico and then to me. So that's why it kind of looks like this. But honestly, I don't mind. I could just clean it up. And this is obviously a concealer, but you could sheer it out to make it a foundation. And if you don't know what the piel blindada is, you guys should look it up because it went viral. A lot of people still like it. I know the technique, but I just haven't posted a video on it. And I did it on me the other day and my skin looked so good, guys. Like, I was so impressed. The next color that I got is AP07. So I got shades that I am able to mix and to create a foundation shade or a contour bronzer shade. So as you can see, this one is not damaged or anything. This is how they actually come. But like I said, I don't mind that it came the other way. I could just clean them out and that's it. And then the next color that I got is AP 3.1. This is a lighter rosy tone. As you can see, a little goes a long way. A little goes a long way. These kind of remind me of the Kevin Aquan uh skin enhancers i believe that they're called but these are way huger like way way huger and then the last color i got is ap06 and that's this color this one is really really pretty as well they have a slight scent but i don't know what it is so for me i would use this as like a, a bronzing shade like a contour shade so yes i did get four and then i also got this she sent this to me for free it's a perfect cut primer for the eyes from the same brand. And this is what it looks like from the inside. I wore this on my lips and it's the most beautiful color ever, guys. This is for me personally. So I literally dipped my fingers, as you can tell. And the color on here is beautiful. This one doesn't have a scent. But this one is the color Cherry. So yeah, it's really, really nice. I would actually use this on my cheeks as well. So I'm probably going to be doing a look with this. And then I also got three um, glitters, I believe. That the, yeah, these are glitters from the same brand. This one is AMP20. And as you can see, it's like a pink shimmery shade. 
it's really really pretty i am collecting a lot of glitters and a lot of foils because november and december are coming up and that's what people typically want this next one is an amp60 and this is more i want to say that this is more peach yeah this is way more peach than the first one like these colors are so pretty guys you see how pretty these are and then the next one is glitter 239 this is a darker one i wanted a darker color this is like a brownish red and it's so so pretty and then i also got this product um it's a magic sealer from atelier paris and i haven't used this one i i have another one that's for the piel blindada but when it comes to this one this is the really really good one el mero mero so I cannot wait to use this. Ese si no lo usado. I cannot wait to use this actually. And last but not least, I have saved the best for last. I think this is the last product that I got. Yes, this is the last product. This product, I am so excited about guys. You have no idea how much I love this. Oh my God, I just got to show you. I'm going to show you the box from the outside. If you know who he is, you know. You know. First of all, how beautiful is he? Like, what the heck? He is so beautiful. Like, I just can't get over how beautiful he is. His work, out of this world. He is one of my favorite makeup artists, period. Like, period, period, period. This is the box. I cannot believe I was able to get my hands on this. I am so excited and so happy that I got this. I'm going to say it did come a little damaged, but that was not going to stop me from keeping the box. Like, no, baby girl, I'm keeping this box. This is going up on my wall. I don't know where. That picture is going to be framed and going in my sala yes i'm gonna keep it and can we get into this box this is so beautiful let me show you the inside i don't think i've seen something so elegant and beautiful in my life like from beauty creations to me this is the best collection that they have it is so elegant it is beautiful let me show you the palette because I'm going to be doing a separate video where I do swatches, a review, and a tutorial. It's going to be a long video, but it's going to be worth it, guys. This is the palette. Whoops, it's this way. <laughs> and let me show you. We do have a big mirror, and these are the colors. Beautiful colors, guys. I am obsessed with this palette. I already did the swatches and everything, and all I can say is this is one of the prettiest palettes and the most beautiful swatches i think i have from beauty creations and you guys know that i like beauty creations a lot and their palettes have been better but like this palette is insane now this one is a face-to-face -face quad like everything all the details are everything and then it's cool that you have like the little sticker so you can know that they're originales so this is the face quad oh my god like this is luxury and the price for this box was 75 bucks 75 bucks that is super cheap guys i don't know about you guys but i thought that that was super cheap we do have another mirror and these are the colors these are so beautiful i love the stamp that he put from his logo from his salon oh my god like get into these colors they are so beautiful like i i, I have nothing bad to say about this and then we do have lippies i do have this one on and i really like this color guys like it's so pretty it's so wearable and since my lips are little this is going to last a long time so i have this one and then this shade this one is more pink and then this one like how beautiful are these oh my god i love glittery shades you guys know this about me but when it comes to these two oh my god and they smell so good they smell like candy but i don't know what kind of candy though and then also we do have a bullet so for people that like to wear lipstick i love to wear lipstick still and this tone is beautiful oh my god like i love it i i i don't have anything bad to say about this and then we do have two lip liners and these are the tones there we go so yes like i said a full review is going to be coming out a lot of looks are going to be coming out with this palette because there's so many things you can do with this palette and i'm so excited that i actually have it in my hands also like i said the antidote 
palette and the liquid shadows are on their way so i cannot wait to get that as well and that is literally it for today's video guys thank you so much for watching i really hope that you enjoyed this video if you like makeup hauls let me know give me a thumbs up and let me know what was your favorite product that i got thank you so much for watching again and i will see you in my next one bye